Hey guys, uh, we have left Toronto and we are uh, in Florida at this point in time. As you can see, this is the port of Costamaya, Mexico. It's a beautiful little port and lots of beautiful shopping areas. As you can see, the flamingos on the left. And a really, really well kept area, really nicely done. I think it took some time and some money. So it's really catered for tourism. You can actually spend the whole day at this at this place, there is swimming pools, there is the open ocean, there is bars, lots of restaurants, um, lots of jewelry places, lots of local items to purchase. So we left there and took a cab at the back of this place. And you got to walk a little while to get to this place. But however, <clears throat> it's eight dollars for the cab ride. And we are now heading to this place called Mahawel. It's about, uh, again, 10 minutes ride from there. Um, the road's a bit bumpy. Uh, well, after all, this is Mexico, so you don't expect anything much better than this because most of Mexico is basically the same. And so here we are in Mahawel. So we are actually approaching the um, Crazy Lobster Restaurant, which is into the left. And we are met by this gentleman called Mauricio. Mauricio is the owner. Really great guy, very hospitable, very welcoming. Um, he was really glad to see us. So yeah, so that's Mauricio. So next time you're heading to um, cost my port as Mauricio at Mahawel. He will treat you really, really well. Nice man. Anyhow, he has a part owner on the side here. It's called Miguel. Miguel was really nice also. So, if you observe, you have a, the groundskeeper said so they kept the place really clean. So all those uh, chairs out front and the Hatch roofs are the exact way you can have your beers and your tacos and your enchiladas and you name it. A really nice place to hang out for the day. I didn't like the washroom. It was, you know, not really up to standard, but acceptable. Anyhow, um, there is the massage station. And um, you can get a massage for $20. And that goes for an hour. So as you can look around, you can see so many chairs, and that's the area for bathing. Um, not very big, not very nice and all that, but acceptable. As you can see, the clouds overhead is really dark, and lots of rain came down on the day that we were there. So they had to move us around quite a bit because the rain was actually coming through on every different direction in this place. So yeah, that's the only thing that I did not like about it. However, on a sunny day, it's a nice and beautiful place to be. As you can see, it's a lot of sand, so they have occupied a lot of sand to place their um, workstations and their tables and chairs. So yeah, pretty nice. And you can see a lobster. He's a red guy, so I call him a red lobster. But anyway, the place is called Crazy Lobster. As you look around, you can see... Um, Basically, not much people today. Um, I guess it was a bit early. We were there probably about like 10 in the morning. And the sh cruise ships left the, in the afternoon probably at 4.30. So yeah, you can actually rent a, a bicycle and get down either walking or using your bike to s tour the area. But we haven't gone further down, but... Um, we like where we, we, we stood by and uh, had our beers and all that. And those are the ladies who do the massages on the side of the beaches there. So yeah, the green, really nice uh, location. So if you're heading to Costamaya, Mexico, you may want to check out this place. It's uh, a great place. Anyhow, I hope you all enjoy this short video. And uh, when next you head into Costamaya, Check out the crazy lobster. Take care. Bye.
Awesome. And what do you do? Tell us. Massage, right? Massage. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Yes. Beautiful. All right.